How's it going? Hi, my name is Michelle and I'm a zero-based barista here in Western Australia and this is just me documenting my journey in getting myself out of the rat race, giving a future for my two-year-old son and obviously the ultimate goal is to get a bit of a nest egg for husband and I to retire when the time is due. We've got a few years before we can but obviously we want to do, want to set up a life for ourselves. All right, so today I have an exciting video. It's saving challenges. Um, and today is extra special because I got a bit of a bonus. I know, um, being in this job for, I would say four months now. And what happened was before I joined, um, the union had already started negotiations with um, the company I work with. And they were talking about, you know, getting an inflation kind of like incentive relief and that got passed. And so we all got a little bit of money, a um, little extra money in our paycheck this time around. However, so and but this was just going to be a one lump sum pay. And obviously they're now negotiating to see, you know, whether there'll be any pay rises. Um, now that is no, I don't get affected by that because obviously I'm new to the company. So I still have to finish all that but this incentive payout like or this inflation incentive payout like to help relief i should say not incentive relief payment um everyone in the company got flat whether it didn't matter when we started so obviously i am super grateful i'm like yes thank you lord um but what i've decided to do rather than you know spend it i am putting it all towards um the savings i need to do so um it's in here i thought of splitting it up but i you know what i was like no that's going to be too much i'll just put it all in the one video because it came from this particular paycheck so i've got one thousand and five hundred dollars that was the in um relief payment so i'm going to put that here um, because I'll show you where I'm putting that and then all of this is going to savings challenges so I've got 50 150 200 250 300 20 40 60 80 100 that's 400 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. So that is 600 there. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. That is 700. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, fifty-five, sixty, sixty-five, seventy, seventy-five, eighty. All right, so that is the money for savings challenges. Um, five hundred, uh, six hundred, seven hundred and eighty. Uh, usually I have never had that kind of money for savings challenges. I will. I am going to be outright like I know what some of you must be thinking you know I wish I had that kind of money this is a one time off this is some bonus money that I've received it doesn't happen all the time I never I never have however I decided that you know before I even think oh let's buy that let's do this let's you know now nah, I'm putting it all towards savings challenges because I know that then I am actively saving and I it's not going to get spent that's how i'm thinking and at the end of the day you know my fundamentals those who have been here for a while uh, would know that to me all money here becomes part of my emergency fund if something was to happen like i will empty out the binders because this money is what i'm doing this for is so that i am never caught undone right so <laughs> even though I, it might be in categories so even my sinking funds i might have it in categories but emergency happens means i will put all that money together that's that one lump sum if i have you know something that comes up so 
without further ado and i tend to make my videos so long um it's important to get started right all right so uh let's see what we can do we're going to try and see if we can finish off as many challenges as we can here um so this one for may is already done this is the bible verse saving challenge we have already finished the seasonal challenge um for autumn so that one is finished for and i need to start the winter so i'll start that in june um self-care because we've got this little extra money here why don't we do a whole forty dollars what i might do is take one of those 50s and put the 10 in here. So 40, so that's 14 and 6. Right? Yeah, that's 20. And 13 and 7, that's 20. need to wait till that dries before I put it in here so that's self-care challenge put that my desk is so full here I don't even know if I'm in focus or in frame apologies if I'm not um because <laughs> um, there's so much happening here maybe I need to stop putting things to the side too much too much happening here right too much is that is that making it any better all right now hopefully that's dry All right, there is one challenge I do, before I do any of the other ones, what I might do is go to um, this one, because I did not put anything in earlier in the month. And I want to finish it, because I have the money why not right so we need how much do we need 35 plus 20 plus 35 plus 50 plus 15 so let me do that again 35 plus 20 plus 35 plus 50 plus 15 155 Just double checking serial notes here. And I'm not doing the bonuses in this savings challenge. Because if just by doing this, I'm going to be able to save $2,023. So why bother with that, right? Okay, so I'm going to put that to the side for now. Put that in here. So I've got 100, 200, 300, 350, 360, 370, 380, 390, 400, 410, 420, 430, 440, 450, 460, 470, 480, 490, 500, 510, 520, 530, 540, 545. Wow, that's amazing. Should put this in the bank, shouldn't I? What I like, I only like touching a challenge 
once I finished it. So I don't know if I can do that. All right, so that one is giving me some relief. Now I'll move on with the rest. <laughs> okay, what am I gonna do here? This is the quarter two savings challenge. Has Caroline said anything about releasing her quarter three? Because I think I'm behind, but I, uh, I could be completely wrong. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to do 15 and 30. And just to be safe in case I'm behind, I'm going to do the 20 as well. Just be maybe ahead, hopefully, or just caught up. So what is that? That is 15 plus 30 plus 20. So that's 65. If I have more money at the end of this, I will come back and I'll finish the bonuses, right? So I need 65. So I have got 50 and 5. So I've got 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. So 170 in the quarter two savings challenge um the car maintenance one is done this may one is done this one is done uh before i do this one i did see some double a's in the tens i should have taken it out as i saw it hey Look at that beautiful old note maybe i should put that one aside because they are big like you don't see those older ones anymore so maybe it's worth collecting i don't know someone comment down below and I'm, I'm caroline will tell me <laughs> um thought i saw hopefully i didn't already there's a double a Look at there's another older note. And there's a double A. Wow. A few double A's. If I find more in the others, I will. These are the older notes, so I might use them for another. I'll put them in the front for now. But these are my double A's. So that will go into my double A saving challenge. Should I count it? Yeah, why not? We got 50, 100, 150, 170, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 280 dollars in the double A series. That's not a bad little haul there, is it? Okay, so which are the now the one challenge that I would like to finish, but I don't know if it's Possible, but we'll give it a good hot go. And this is my 50 envelope challenge. I will speed this through because that will just take too much time. Um, so I'll see if I can finish it here. Yeah? Um, so at this point, I'm going to speed this part up so you're not here for too long.
I have to use my pocket money. I use my pocket money. Wow. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use my pocket money because there's no way I'm going to collect this one of the books. Alright, I know this is not how you're supposed to do challenges. You're supposed to take your time and do what you can, but I have this bonus money and I was determined to finish. Um, so I'll put this point into my point challenge later. But here you have it. I have just completed my 50 emerald challenge. I will do an unstuffing. Later down the track. A um, couple of um, have asked me about my Etsy store and the only reason why I haven't started my Etsy store is because I'm doing some study. I didn't want to start something and not give it its due um, like importance in my life. So I, I want to give it, you know, so if someone does make an order, I can get it out quickly as possible. So this is one of the things I would like to put in my um, storefront. And hopefully in the next few weeks I will be finishing that course so I can then open up my shop and at least sell some few items that I am enjoying making and hopefully you guys will also enjoy it but I will keep you guys posted how it goes. Uh, and that's it, that's my 50 euro challenge all done. It's so good, it feels so good. I actually don't know how much this will come to. I've never done the math. I should do the math. But that I will make sure that um, I... But there is some money here. So we got 10, 20, 30. I am... There is one challenge that I can put that to. And that will be this one here. Look at the mess I have on my desk. Next time I will find a proper box for my <laughs> thing challenge. Alright, I'm gonna put you to the side for now. <laughs> There's this one here, it's $30 that I have left. Um, but I'm gonna follow a this will be the last thing I color for this month um, because obviously I targeted all my other same challenges this one didn't get as much love which is fine you know these things happen so I'll do 20 and that's all I could do this month but and that way I've kept the older notes for my challenge and still with feel that is many all right now some of you must be asked, wondering what I'm doing with this money here. I thought about it and I was like, should I take it out as cash and put it towards other savings challenges? And I thought, nope, I'm going to use that big chunk of money where I put my binder. It was right there. Maybe. Ugh. Sometimes I think that if my head was not on my neck i would forget that all right so there's the binder that i needed so this money here i've been wanting an ipad for a very long time uh however i've decided i'm not just going to use that money and just go and buy it i'm going to think about it do my research maybe wait for a sale um like you know in jb high five because i do have my money here um, from my voucher there's two hundred dollars on that um i have the money that my mom gave me so i've got that money there and i have been putting money aside so i've decided if it'll stay in here if something comes up that is an emergency then at least i know i have this money here it's in my wish list but 
I rather keep it now at the moment. Like I do know that I want my iPad. I want an iPad Pro and I've been wanting it for a very, very long time and since last year. But, you know, I always put other things as priority first. And part of me was like, let's put this as priority. But I've decided that it's important that I look after myself. Or, but at the same time, I don't want to just go and spend it without thinking about it. If I can get a good price on it, I'd rather do that. So I'm going to put that in here. If something comes up, at least I know the money is there. And so it, this goes into my wish list. So I've made the transfer already. That's why I'm representing it with placeholder. Now, fun story. I found some money while I was doing laundry. Isn't that the best kind of money to find? Uh, you know, this is what happens if hubby wants me to do the laundry. I do check the pockets and he had... 5, 10, 15, 20 dollars in his pocket and he totally forgot it's so obviously it's from his pocket money and I was like nope I did the laundry I'm not giving it back to you so that money is now mine <laughs> and this is the 10 dollars that was from rollover uh, when I was doing the cash envelopes so this goes into this binder of mine so first things first I am going to do the mini savings challenge. This one is from Caracash. And I am putting in. Where's my marker? Oh. So, first things first, we're going to do 15 here. This is a different one. Oh, well. So, 5, 10, 15 goes there. So this one I'm saving towards my momcation, which is coming up in a matter of a few weeks. So that's getting exciting. So for, I've got 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65. $65 for the momcation. Not long to go for this little mini savings challenge, which is absolutely perfect. It's only, it saves you a hundred dollars, which is perfect. All right, so now the money here. First up, beauty is getting five. So I've got sixty dollars here in beauty. I do have to go and get my eyebrows done. So that's saving up. Fun. I am going out to dinner with a few of my friends so I could use this money towards that. So I've got 10, 20, 30. I did use up my pocket money so. I wonder if hubby will share his pocket money with me since I used mine for a savings challenge. No harm in asking, right? All right, and $5 is going to a shopping. So I've got 50, 100, 105 in shopping. All right, so I'll put this one back. And there you have it. There's... Savings challenge is done. I just like putting it out here. <sighs> How good does that feel? I finished this savings challenge. Took me a while, but I got there. All right, everyone. There's, that's it for now. I'll definitely do another video to unstuff this and I'll let you know where I'm putting this money. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, do consider sitting the like button, um, leaving me a heart emoji down in the comments. So, you know, I'd love to interact with all of you. Um, I do take my time to interact at the moment because I am trying to juggle a few things out there. <laughs> um, but, you know, I do do eventually get to um, commenting anyway everyone take care before i ramble anymore look after yourselves till the next time bye